Hey guys, it's Matt here from Commentary Blitz. We are at MK Code Breakers today. The sun is shining. It is a blessing, I tell you. Not quite as hot as our last tournament down in Bristol. Uh, it's still nice and warm nonetheless. So this is our seventh tournament of the season. Uh, we are obviously, there's no leagues around us. So, you know, Commentary, we are a tournament team at the moment. Uh, but we're trying to enter as many tournaments as we can. Uh, we do like this tournament, especially because they're our, uh, our nearest neighbours, pretty much. So, hello, MK. Um, yeah, win one, lost one so far. So, a bit of a mixed start, but we'll hopefully we'll get it going in game number three. All right, see you soon. Bye. Hey, so, just going to tell you about uh, the actual game of softball. Um, for those that don't know what it looks like at tournaments. Uh, so, there's minimum of 10, maximum of 12 on each team. Uh, you have to have an even split between uh, guys and girls, males and females, or like, as we like to call them, big ball hitters and small ball hitters. Uh, so generally we'll play sort of four or five games in a day. Uh, depends how well we do, whether we make it to the finals, you know, knockout games will dictate how many we actually play in total. Um, normally we have an hour on and then we have an hour off between each game. It's nice, you know, have a little break. Uh, it gives us time to stretch again before we play as well. Unfortunately, it was not to be against the Rhinos, so not the best day for us. The bats just weren't working today. The field was pretty good, you know, we really picked it up in the field. But our day and therefore our outdoor season is now finished. So thank you to everybody who's joined us at tournaments this year. Thanks to MK for putting on another great tournament. And we'll see you for our indoor sessions on the 9th of October at the Allen Higgs Centre at 6pm in the Dome. Okay, that's all for me. Hope you enjoyed this video. Yeah.